What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I know it's been a while since the last time I've uploaded, but let me assure you, it's worth it. Today, we're gonna be making a miniature ski ball machine. The difficulty of this project is probably about a four out of 10. And to put this in perspective, because it's a completely new system that I've created, my old video, the paper airplane launcher, is probably around a two. So this one is a bit more difficult, but the end result is all that much better. So for this project, you're gonna need a cardboard box, some hot glue, and a ping pong ball. So let's begin. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is cut one of the flaps of the box. And what you're gonna do with this is you're gonna cut it in half so you get two identical shapes. Uh, the next thing you want to do is cut out one side of the box so that you, know, you get a rectangle like this. And then you're going to cut out another flap so you get another rectangle. You want to cut out two 2 inch by 4 inch pieces from that flap you just cut out. And then glue in those pieces like shown in the picture on one of the halves uh, that you cut out earlier. All right, the next thing you want to do is glue this flap onto a, the long board and you've created a uh, part of the main board. This is a stand for the back of it, so you just want to glue that on like that. And the next thing you want to do is cut out the whole pattern. Remember that all the holes have to be above the diagonal slats, otherwise the ball will get stuck inside the machine. Then you want to glue that like it's shown in the picture and it works. Then you wanna cut off a piece of the board that is 1.5 inch by the board width. This is your kind of kick up ramp. Then you wanna make safeguards all around it so that the ball doesn't you know, fly off in all directions. Then you wanna create the side cups. This is where the ball will go when it goes through any of the score holes. Now originally I had an idea to make these return channels that go all the way back, but that idea kind of didn't work. So I instead ended up going with a simple cup that just holds the ball. All right, so that was the whole building of it. It is now complete. And when you're done, it should look something like this. So basically you just roll the ball up and that's it. It's just like ski ball, baby. Once again, like with the previous uh, paper airplane launcher, I cannot stop playing with this thing. It is so much fun. And the best part about it is that you can make your own rules. It doesn't have to be 20, 20, and 50 like it is on mine. You can be 10, 10, and a million. You can make your own mini games with this. You can, no matter how you play it, this thing is super fun. And it is not that difficult to make. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash like, subscribe, check out this video, subscribe to my channel here, and I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.